Hey guys, this is Nick and welcome to part 3 of our Windows Switcher's Guide to Elementary OS. In this part, we'll talk about managing your windows on Elementary OS. First, the basic window. This is pretty standard. You have a window, you can drag it around, resize it by going to any corner of the window. Pretty standard fare, just like Windows. You'll notice that you can only close it by default and that the window controls are on the left, whereas on Windows, they are on the right of the window. Of course, you can minimize a window just by clicking on its icon on the dock. If it's the active window, it will be minimized. Click on its icon again to bring it back. To maximize a window, you can double click on its title bar or press super, or the Windows or Command key, plus up. You'll also notice that most apps on elementary OS do not have a title bar. It combines a toolbar with the title bar. It means more real estate on your screen, but can also be sometimes annoying. You'll have to aim precisely to drag a window. Except you don't have to aim precisely, because you can press the super key, again, Windows or Command key, and drag the window by any point of that window, which is very, very useful. Tiling a window. Just as on Windows, you can make a window occupy a part of your screen just by dragging it to a side. Just grab the window and drag it to one side of the screen. It will automatically resize to use half of that screen. Drag it to the top and it maximizes, drag it down again and it will get back to its normal size. That's pretty easy. Seeing all your windows. Now when you have a lot of open windows, it can get a little messy. To see all your windows at a glance, you can click the multitasking icon on the dock. This one, down here, all blue and shit. It will, re it will resize all your windows to a more manageable size and allow to close them or switch to a specific window. You can also middle click with the scroll wheel on any window you want to close. You can also bring that multitasking view by pressing super plus down. Now we can push it a little bit more. You can also add a hot corner to launch the multitasking view. To do this, open the System Settings app, click on Desktop, then Hot Corners. You can then map any window-related command to a corner of the screen. When your mouse pointer hits this corner, it will bring the desired view. I myself use the top right corner to bring the multitasking view, but you could use it to show the desktop or to open the Applications menu, for example. Alt-Tabbing of course you can Alt-Tab just like on Windows. Press Alt plus Tab and the dock will show only open apps. Press Alt-Tab to switch to the next app on the dock. Super plus Tab will switch to the next workspace. Workspaces. You'll notice that the multitasking view allows you to see the start of a second screen on the right side. This is a virtual desktop. It allows you to sort your windows and quickly switch from one group to another. For example, you could have your work stuff on one desktop and your browsing stuff on another. To create another desktop, just click the plus icon in the multitasking view. Drag any window you want to that desktop to make it stick to there. Then click on the icon of the workspace you want to use. You can also quickly switch between desktops by pressing super plus the right or left arrow on your keyboard. Well, there you go, that's it for window management. In the next part, we'll talk about the default elementary OS apps. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys in the next part. Bye!